Good morning, lovely day for it. It's fantastic to be back in the tent. I've got my Omani coffee and some flapjack from my last hosts. I'm excited for the day. Um, it was a bit rough going yesterday. Hopefully I've got some energy back this morning. today I think I was dehydrated yesterday I've left camp this morning with all four liters of water bottles empty so maybe I need to work harder on drinking water throughout the day turned off the main road this is my punishment not much traffic but quite steep gorgeous I'm still inspired by the beauty, so that's a good distraction. This is the sleepy fishing village of Koryat and I've arrived in prime nap time. Everything's closed, only the kids and the goats are out. building is, a like government building I suppose with all these flags, but there's drinking water and whatever is in this flask. No way, it's coffee and dates. Why is there coffee and dates and water outside this building? I think it says something about God and the Saud family. Thank you, Saud family for my coffee. I poked my nose in the open gate to say thank you. Fortunately, I found a group of women in there. I'm still none the wiser as to, I suppose it's, it's a Islamic charitable thing, is it? To leave coffee and dates out. I'm a big fan, whatever it is. I'm not having much luck with these forts. Wrong time of day. pitch my tent on that long stretch of sand east of the little turret but it would appear I won't be leaving this way at high tide it's supposed to be 
be camping on the beach tonight, but my track has turned to sand and I'm still half a kilometre from the beach. So no swim for me. I'll just pitch up here in the dunes. Feeling ever so slightly missold on my dinner tonight. This picture here is not exactly what I'm going to be eating out of the can here, along with some Indian fried snacks, uh, pitta, and my favourite Omani sweet halwa. Nom nom nom. First place I stopped, I noticed just in time all of the animal tracks, so I've moved up the dune and hopefully uh, will not have 500 sheep and a couple of shepherds coming through. 